Welcome back to another episode of Series TV. We are coming to you from sunny South Africa, and this is our first day that we're getting in the blind. But we have two special guests. We have Matt and Colt Metcalf. They are coming all the way from Houston, Texas. Just friends of ours that we met through Houston Safari Club and said, hey, we're going, you wanna go? And they're like, sure, let's go. So we've got a few things on the list. We're getting ready to climb in the blinds. I know that Matt's wanting to get um, the Golden Wildebeest and Eclipse Springer and some odds and ends. And uh, he hasn't collected in the many times he's been here. And I think Colt's looking for a sable and a few things on his list. So I know we're in a good spot for it stuff's on the cameras and we're gonna get going He's done. You smoked. That's a good one. Watch him. He's not going to go far. Is that a good shot? Yes, absolutely. Yes. <laughs> He's stuck in him. Dude, he just smoked that sable. He, I mean, he snow plowed down through the brush. Um, it took us forever to get a shot because there were kudu in the way or he wasn't clear for a shot. It was just so much. I think it was like a 10, 15 minutes. <coughs> But I'm pretty sure I saw him go down in there. He was dragging, going through the brush. So yeah. we're gonna we're gonna give it some time. We're gonna go look for him. It was so fun. They were fighting, and as soon as they stopped for just a minute, I slowly squeezed that trigger, and it let off. Surprised me, and it just stuck right in him. He's done.
Oh, it looks good. Yeah. Can't pull it all the way up. All right. Real slow after he's on the road. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude. That is a stud. Oh, my God. It was. That perfect was shot. So we are getting ready to go track his sable. I don't think he went far. But we'll see. You want to go to where you shot him? Uh, yeah, there he is. Right here. Right over. Right over here. Yep. They're eating this feeder. And then they bumped horns and started fighting over here. Standing over here. Shot the one on the left right here. And you ran back over there. Well, you just gotta go track them. I see him? Yeah, we got him, dude. Where is he at? Straight out there. Hands on him. You, your animal. You put first the hands on him. That's back. I keep you stretched out so they may back. That's awesome, dude. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, man. oh, oh, that's awesome. That's cool. Still razor sharp. It's ready for another go. Where do you want to be, Connor? <laughs> Take it again. What do you think, Colt? Oh, he's awesome, man. That was so fun. My heart was racing, and it felt like forever when I was aiming down the sides trying to get a good shot. And as soon as they stopped fighting, slowly squeezed the trigger. Got him, and he ran off. We went and tracked him, and he was down, and sure enough, he's. 41 inches and one quarter. So he's a monster. He's an absolute stud. It's awesome. So after the sable and the wildebeest, we didn't see anything else today. So that's going to wrap up this week's episode. Tune in next week. Day two is coming around the corner.